What's up guys, John here, playing another episode of Legend of Lagaya. Uh, last episode we basically bum-rushed that giant berserker boss and got our asses handed to us. Uh, I knew that was gonna happen, I was just like, I kinda wanna see just how accurate my memory is, because I remember constantly getting my ass kicked by that boss so many times. Uh, cause he, he doesn't... I'm not sure if he has a ton of HP, but I know he hits like a goddamn truck. So, you know, he has one, like, uh, area of effect attack that will, like, damage everyone for at least half their health, so it's, it's fucky. So I went in and tried it, knowing I'm gonna lose, and I just wanted to kind of see exactly how bad it was. Uh, but, um... So, uh, then uh, in between episodes I did some grinding, and, um, basically at the point where all my MP is gone and everything, so I'm just kind of, uh, want to head back to the last uh, inn or whatever to heal, <clears throat> but uh, I realized there was that town I saw off in the distance, and if I recall correctly, I'm pretty sure that place is actually safe from the mist, for reasons that I won't spoil just yet. Um, pop. Dead. But, uh, I'm gonna head there, because I think I can heal there. Shut up, Vaughn. Instead of heading all the way back to the uh, ancient wind cave or whatever it was the last place. Uh, also, while I was grinding, uh, everybody has now absorbed uh, the sortie. So we now have that uh, Sarah we can summon, which is pretty key. <clears throat> so I think it's just, yeah, you see those? Yeah, because you see the windmills? The windmills, I remember this. The windmills... Uh, well, I mean, it's not really spoilers, it's pretty freaking obvious, but the windmills, uh, basically blow the mist away, which is the opposite of how windmill works, with, oh, windmills work, lip kid and an oak slime, oh, this is so fancy, <laughs> um, but yeah, uh, windmills are powered by the wind, they don't create the wind, they're not fans, but, uh, in this game they are. <laughs> And, uh, yeah, they, they basically blow the mist away and keep it away from the town. Um, although you'd think that, like, monsters that are already out in the mist and already turned into monsters would still, like, come and attack the town, but, you know, whatever. Um, <clears throat> so... Ew, looks like sewage. <clears throat> yeah, yeah, just kill it. But, uh, so we're gonna go over there and heal. Because then, not only will we be able to heal there, we can also check out a new town and everything. And, uh, then we'll come back here... ...and, uh... ...take another shot at that boss and have a... ...have a try on, uh... <clears throat> ...reviving that there Genesis tree there. Let's just see if I can get to this town without getting knocked out, because I'm pretty... I mean, you saw I'm low on health. I think... I think I have some MP left for Brufus. I think everyone else is out. Oh, Brufus has plenty of MP, okay. Yeah, just veer everybody up. Oh, Vera's magic level increased, hooray. Oh, yeah, we're in good shape then. I mean, I'm not gonna head back there and try more grinding, but there's no way in hell we're not gonna make it uh, to this town. What's that stone ruins over there? Oh, look, there's a couple. There's a bunch of stuff over there. Huh. And of course, I go <laughs> just fucking stray one step too far. What do we got? Oh, Jesus! Poisonous, it's a caterpie and a Whatever the hell that horrifying thing is. I think we're kind of fucked here. Uh, let's see. You know what? You have the magic for it. Let oh, we don't have enough to use the swordy. God damn it. Use a theater. That should do some decent damage. And... Oh, wow. Oh, I thought that... For some reason, I guess the numbers were just on top of each other, but it looks like they were like three-digit numbers instead of two-digit. I'm like, oh, this is going to kill it. Ding! And pause, and summon, and then sit there for a second, and then laser penis, and then charge it up, and then fire, and everybody dead. And then pause for a second, oh, theater increased, and then sit there for a second, and then he wins, and then sit there for a second. That's, that's the one, that's why I skip a lot of the random battles when I'm recording in this, because it's just... Uh, yeah, there's just, it's just like, there's so much just sitting there and waiting. Yes. This town, what does it do?
Vidna. Oh shit, these people aren't murdered to death. Oops, wrong button. Well, what do you know? You're my first customer since the mist came. Your first customers for what? We didn't buy anything from you. Before the mist came, there were plenty of tourists in town, the tour guide. No. <laughs> I just wanted to. <laughs> 200 goo per night. East. I have no idea how much goo I have in this. I just played like four or five episodes of Fantasy Star 4. And oh, another dream. God damn it. Fucking dreams. I have no idea what voice I did for this. And I'm not even going to bother for the fucking her parents or whatever. Ah, Cuntlet, I can sense her too. It's Cuntlet, my daughter. My daughter that I named Cuntlet, because <laughs> I hated her. So warm, such a pure heart. She's growing up healthily. She seems to have made some wonderful friends. Alright, can we just go, like... Who is it? Who's... Who is it? Who's there? Cuntlet, it's me, your father, and your mother, and yeah, just go. My father, father, is that your father, father, his mother, their mother, father, mother, father, your mother, father. Yes, but both of us are watching over you. I, I want to see you, I want to see your mother. Yeah, just go, like, I don't care about this. She's having a dream, they're trapped in eternal darkness. All they can do is send you the watts, her words through her dreams. It pains her to send her words like this. Just go, I don't care. This is like 10 minutes of cutscene for two minutes of dialogue. Father. Mother wants to see you too, Cuntlet. We're waiting for you. We're a couple of flashing, blinking lights. Just hang on. Just hang on, Mother, Mother. I'll be there soon. I'm coming. I'll go where the deepest mist is to see you. Just go. Like. <laughs> There's so much just pausing and waiting and doing nothing in this game, you know? All right, I'm all healed up and everything. I think I got... Did I pick up that, uh, forest amulet? Rot. Okay, I don't really need that. That's the one thing I picked up from, like, right next to the Berserker, but I didn't actually fight it this time. No, I don't care. What's up here? Can I steal some shit? Oh! Haha, <laughs> I stole some shit! Nice. Nice! Nice. Remember, kids, always root through other people's cupboards when you break into their houses. There's usually free shit. No, what's the Gate of Shadows? Ancient ruin east of Octum. Called a gate, there's no roads that lead anywhere. Some say an ancient treasure, nobody knows for sure. If the mists weren't there, you'd check for yourself. Cool, so we're supposed to go do that at some point. Okay. What's this lady? Before the mist, oh, it's a resort town, cool. Uh, oh, we got item shop. Let's see if they have anything decent. <clears throat> Sell me some shit, motherfucker. Ah! Let's see, metal ring. I already have one of those, I think. Golden compass, silver compass, venom and toxin. Don't really need any of this. I mean, healing flower, healing bloom. I'll get some of these. Get, like. That's a decent chunk of change, but at least I won't be, like, hurting for healing items anytime soon. Okay, that's good. Do I have anything to sell? <laughs> Bitch, please, fist. I kind of, like, part of me kind of wants to keep these just because it's named the Bitch, Please Fist and the Cuntlet Feral, but, eh, really no point. It's only 250G, but still. Like, it's just going to take up space in my, in my inventory. And there is enough pointer to that. Yeah, be quiet. What's this person say? Yeah, buy lots of healing news and travel on yourself. Cool story, I don't care. Free shit! I could have just not bought anything and just stolen everything from all the cupboards in this town. I mean, not that I'm not going to still... <laughs> Uh, steal everything from all the cupboards in this town, but you know, I wouldn't have had to spend money first. Let's see, there's a beach. Small children. No, I do not know Danfus. West edge of town. Cool. Room. Uh huh, windmill's cool. Uh, neat. Cool story, bro. 
Anything? Oh, beach babes. See some boats. What's this guy? Can I steal it? Can I steal it from you? I remember there is a um. Oh, the, yeah. There's a um. There's a fishing mini game in here. And you can like there's there's shit you can only get with like the points you get for fishing. Donpus. Okay, Donpus is like the boy who cried wolf. Apparently. Uh, what's in here? Oh shit! People. Hey, bro, this looks people from Byron. It's a lot of Byron people. Byron, Byron, Byron. It's people from Byron. <gasps> Surprise! Rufus, what's wrong? I thought Byron people were your friends. It's just that I violated the teaching of Byron by wearing Ozma. What's the matter, Rufus? I will forgive you. Then why? Bitch, please, say something, Rufus. You stupid, say it. But. Rufus, bitch, please, is right. And what's more, I'll kick you in the dick. And uh, Ozma is Nasero. He's a Rasero, so shut up. Rasero? Did you just say Rasero? Maybe. That's right. A Rasero isn't the same thing as Seru. Oh, Hari, your prophecy has come true. And you are... Allow me to introduce myself. I am Sashia. Sashia, are you a friend of Hari's? Not really a friend. I serve Hari. I am a priestess of the Temple of Rem. Before the mist came, Hari instructed me to go to Vidna. I was to wait for three youths wearing Rosser and give them the, the message. He, Hari knew that we would come here? Shit. Wow, that Hari is amazing. Where is he? I want to meet him. I want to kick him in the balls. I'm, I'm sure that Hari awaits your visit too. I shall now give you the message as instructed by Hari. <clears throat> Go to the Temple of Rem. See the four books of prophecy. When you have seen them all, the secret will be clear. A brave Rasu will acquire the great key. The Star Pearl. Exposition. Four books of prophecy? Star Pearl? What is this video game exposition? Dude. Hari said that with this, the use wearing Rasu would find a way. Uh, fuck that. Excuse me, but... I have heard of you. You are a Byron, yes. I don't know why I'm also Bane, but sure. Actually, not anymore. Things being the way you are, I am sure there are very good reasons. Nonetheless, you are visitors that Shashishisha has waited all that time. Please rest here. Of course I didn't have to fucking bother paying for sleep with that. And I probably would have gotten that stupid uh, cutscene here as well. The Temple of Rem is an Octum. Good luck. Punch and punch and sir, I heard the Hari. Cool, sir. Masters are. Oh yeah, she's in Gotham City, but the Joker. Cool. Let's see. Good thing I actually visited that fucking thing, or I could have just missed that whole thing. This bitch has yellow. Oh, Mrs. Danpas. No, we didn't come to see Donpus. I don't know who that is. You guys keep on fucking... Is this a stair? Where is this Oh, shit. The shelter's completed and ready any time. The windmill stopping? That can never happen. Besides, the food here is good. Oh, I guess, guess Donpus is like a doomsday prepper? Do you realize how serious the situation is? Sure. The townspeople don't realize how horrible the mist is. Don't you fellows agree? Again, sure. You see... You know, you seem pretty smart. Would it happen with the real when, what would happen if the windmill stop? We'd get fucked. We'd be eaten by the air or posed by them. That's why I'm preparing for when that happens. I built an underground shelter because mist and air can't come underground. Fools! They laughed at me. They all laughed at me. Now who's laughing now? <laughs> he crazy. I mean, he's not wrong, but he is crazy. <laughs> cool. That was worth. Spending time to come to this, this house. <laughs> see what's over here. Just take out one of my Sarah and just blow up the fucking windmill. Which, again, windmills don't work that way. You have it backwards. Windmills are blown by air. They don't create wind. Have you bathed in the hot spring? No. Oh, the, 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 shut up and go. Yeah, we get it. You're an old man. You want to peek it on a snake. It's creepy and weird. Go away. Hello, person. They say this arrow turns savage and possess people when touched by the mist, but here there's no mist, so you can wear safe safely. Of course, there's no need for them. Cool story, bro. I guess these guys are wearing sarah. I guess that's the blue things on their heads are. 
Let's see, what kind of weaponage? Let's, ooh, better stuff, cool. Uh, that's best for bitch piaz, but already. So I, I remember, um, I have Rufus equipping something that's that's best for bitch please. So it makes his attack thing, the um, like the icon is bigger. So it would it would it it makes it so you can do less stuff. Okay, let's see. Now I need. Okay, this is good because I can buy a bunch of armor. Um. Oh Jesus! This is holy fuck. This is expensive. Ugh. Yeah. Jeez. All right. Let's let's do that. Because I can buy armor and increase my defense. That'll do his attack too, but. Like, I can basically just afford... Well, I can sell some of this when I'm done. Alright, let's sell the stuff we just unequipped. Iron Man. Iron Man. Save your clothes. Sell that. Okay, now we can afford... This. What, they don't have anything for Cuntlet? That's rude. Okay... Sell power plate that I just... Wait, isn't the power plate what I... Oh, fighting plate is what I just bought. Okay, I was about to say. Um, let me sell that then. Okay, sell the power plate. I don't think I was buying anything right now. No, I don't. Okay. Um... So I think after this we'll go grind some more. Free shit. <laughs> I'm debating on whether or not I should just take another rush at the boss. Because I got the... I mean, I got those items with increased defense. And I did level up, I think, once, maybe twice. But, oh, what's this? The machine room in the heart of... Did, did, yeah, cool. Uh, ooh, free shit, free shit, free shit. Oh, I can't open that cabinet. The fuck is that? Oh, it's an old naked man. Well, well, visitors. The machine room. Hot, huh? Sure. Hot water and steam comes... Powers the windmill, windmills you cool things out for the tourists. Again, not how windmills work. Stupid. So it's geothermal power. Neat. Uh I was gonna say you wanna like load the Oh, there's a chest down there. Oh, I think Just break this, just smash it. Okay, I can't. This is supposed to be hot spring water, but it looks like hot oil. I'm pretty sure if I jump in here... Yeah, I get burned. <laughs> Lel. You dumbass, the water's hot, you stupid fuck. No, you didn't, you didn't say that. I didn't? Well, fuck you. Stupid fucking dumb kids. Fucking kill you. All right, so I know at some point... Something happens to this town that makes the hot water stop coming, and then I can get whatever is in those chests. But I think that's... I think that's later, like, after, um... I think that's after I finish Jeremy, maybe? I don't know. What's this lady say? Yes, I do. It's the fucking windmills! We get it! And you don't get that windmills don't fucking work that way! You anger me! Go into your fucking hot springs. Cool story. What do you say? It's boring. Yada yada. Yada. Pay kid. Play. Kid. Oh, cool coins. Oh god, it's got a slot machine mini game. Fan fucking tastic. I uh, used to charge people that. As you can go for free. So as long as you want, it, feel fresh. Cool story. Pretty sure this is beneath the Skabuckakas Island. There's hot springs. Cool. Free shoe. A phoenix. Nice. I can revive people what got dead. Okay, we got hot springs. There's a naked old man. Secret to a long life. Cool story. I wonder if this actually heals you if you go in. Probably. Or not. Okay, cool. I think I can go out the back way here. And there's a... Uh, let's see. Yeah. What's here? Oh, there's more houses. Okay. What do you say? Do you wish to hear a song? Sure. Oh, god damn it. Of course, this is some kind of prophecy. The star is silent here, the moon shining smile, a ship of dreams sails the Milky Way. Look now, there it is, the gate of shadows. Hari waits there. Hari has one heart, but Hari has three faces. Hari has three mouths. Hari dreams through dreams. That wasn't a song at all. None of that rhymed. 
cool. So why are you kids home alone? Like, also, mommy's not at the hot spring. There was literally no women there. Pepe. Mother's there still as far as I know. Pepe's name is Alan. He's a jeweler. Sorry if only mist would go away. Oh yeah, I remember there's at some point... I think that there's a thing like after I fix Jeremy... I have to come back here and talk to him for that. Uh... Huh, cool. Okay. Um, I'm gonna see what that little slot machine thing does and I think we'll probably call this an episode. Move. Move! Um, jeez. Is it literally just like a fucking casino? It's literally just a casino fucking clock slot machine. Boo. Picks up three coins per time. Cool. That was point full. As opposed to pointless, but no, that was pointless. Okay, go. Damn, that took a I had to buy more from him. No, one coin? Go fuck yourself! No, fuck you! Crackhead ass motherfucker. Uh, okay, but I think we'll call that an episode. Uh, we're gonna head back to uh, Jeremy. Probably grind some more. But uh, I'll do that off screen and then we'll go ahead and fight the boss again. Uh, thanks for watching, guys. Bye!